Merhaba Turk arkadaşlarım. Merhaba uh, Turk. Me and Evan are back with another video. Nailed uh, it. Nice try. <laughs> uh, <laughs> That's good. All right. Anyways, uh, we're gonna do a non-music video today. We're just gonna see how it goes. Hopefully, you guys like it. Hopefully, we like it. Hopefully, we enjoy it. Uh, I've been getting um, consistent comments about doing another uh, Jim Yilmaz uh, stand-up or video, uh, just his comedy stuff. Uh, it's kind of hard sometimes because a lot of his videos get copyright blocked for me personally, so kind of turns me off from doing more of it. But we'll we'll we'll try, and if if it does, I'll try to edit it in, in a way that allows to keep the important bits of our our our reaction and. But allows for it to upload to YouTube without problem. Anyways, uh, I so thank you for translating this. Uh, this was it's called "Woman Were Created to Convince." Gotcha. All right. So <laughs> this guy might enough, might, in, might, in might, itself, yeah. might might relate more to it since he's a married guy um, with four freaking daughters. Four daughters. Yeah. Yikes. That's uh, four too many. Only boys allowed. All right. That's. Uh, that joke. All right. <laughs> All right, let's go. Chem Yelmaz woman were created to convince. Şöyle haber çıkıyor. Erkeğin işte o genetik şifresi, beyni, bilmem nesi çekildi. Termal bilmem nesi çekildi. Yalan söyleyen bölümünün büyük olduğu göre erkekler yalancıdır. Tapa. Bilgiye bak. Erkekler çok yalan söyler. İskoç bilim adamları açıkladı diye bir de altına böyle bir küçük işte yapıyor. Gaz veriyorlar. Ha, İskoç bilim adamı oysa doğrudur o zaman. <gülüyor> Bir arada İsveç, neydi? İsviçre bilim adamları vardı. Üç açılı diş macunu. Hırsızı bak. Bilim adamına ben ne güveneceğim lan? Erkek yalancıdır. Tespitinin mesela yalan olduğu zaman çok açık. Ben erkeği yep. buradan biliyorum. Erkek yalancıdır. Erkek yalan söyleyecek donanım yoktur ki erkekte. Yalan söylemeyecek kadar melektir. I think we're too stupid to lie. Kadın yalancı mıdır? Master degree. <gülüyor> Ondan sonra problem çıkıyor. Erkek yalan söyleyemediği için yalan ihtiyacı olur. Söyler, söyleyemediği için yakalanır. Exactly, yeah. Yalancılıkla ilgili paradoks var. Yani yalancı yalanı söyleyemeyen adama denir. Söyleyebilen adama yalancı diyemezsin çünkü söyleyebilmiştir. Anladın? Geçmedi mi daha filtreden? <gülüyor> Yani şunu diyor, kadın yalan söylemekle ilgili donanımı çok yüksek olduğu için çok ustalıkla söyler, zaten tespit edemezsin. Bizimkiler erkeğin ki çok çocuksu olduğu için yeah, yeah. yakın. Uh, sure. Onun için dedi ki yalancısın sen. E söyleyemedim ki dur zaten ondan belli olur. <gülüyor> Onun için erkeğin buradaki duruşu daha naif buluyor. Bizde öyle bir mekanizma gelişmiş. Erkek çocuğu daha serbest yetiştiriliyor. Hani daha yalana ihtiyacı yok oluyor. Bizim toplumda daha belirli. Erkek çocuğun çıplak fotoğrafı çektirilir. Yani mahremi örtmemekle, kusuru örtmemekle ilgili öyle bir bilinçaltı gelişiyor. Bu da bizim oğlumuz. Çırıl çıplak fotoğraf vardır ya. Bu da bizim oğlan. This is so true. Çocuk var böyle fotoğraf. Nadir. Erkeğin çok var ama. Bu da bizim oğlumuz. Buyurun. Belli yaşayan evde donsuz gezmeler. I want to stop here because it's funny, but uh, there's some truth to a lot of what he's saying. Yeah, especially with the the whole naked pictures. Yeah, as a as a newborn, like how often do you see a newborn baby that's a male compared to a, a female? You see more of the, the the baby, right? Okay, at least in my in my experience, I've seen like there's more. I feel like there's more. Naked pictures of uh, newborn males than there are females. Okay. Would you say that's? I mean, I don't know what we're talking about. Are we just talking about newborn pictures? Like when you take pictures of your newborns? Yeah. There's more. But they're wearing their diaper. They're covering up. No, their they're like parts. naked. Do you see their private parts? Yes. I don't. I I haven't seen anything like that. <laughs> really. I think maybe it maybe a booty cheek or two. I think this is the I think this is where the the cultural difference comes in. Yeah, because for sure I've seen uh and I've been <laughs> I've been <laughs> uh a part of that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got a couple of you got a couple of nudies out there that nobody knows about. <laughs> Subscribe to my only fans. <laughs> That's illegal by the way. Don't do that. Um, oh shoot! 
<laughs> okay, yeah, I guess this is where the code because there I I've from the way I grew up, I've seen more like there are like basically naked baby pictures of gotcha. males but not necessarily females. Hmm. So I guess yeah. Well, I mean, I only have girls. And we did we did sure newborn photos with all four of them. But, but they were all like diapers and stuff. Or or if anything it was a little tushy tush. And those sure. and those were those ones didn't make it online, but those ones were for the photo album. Sure, yeah. I, yeah, yeah, exactly. It's kind of a thing, but never like I mean, none the, of, the private private parts. No, no, no. I'm not saying so, that some of these pictures are being online or whatever. No, I'm saying like I post on my Facebook of like my new oh. pictures and they might have, you know, been naked to the point they had <laughs> tissues. Anyways. No. Yeah, I But yeah, I hear I, I, I totally agree with you. It's, I I totally hear what you're saying with what this guy's saying. I feel it's like you're more, more likely to do it if you have a son than you than do you, if yeah, you have a daughter. 100%. Isn't he my son? After all, I cut your pee-pee. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's, uh, let's let's go back a little bit. <laughs> oh, oh, there's some truth to this for sure. Back <laughs> <laughs> <laughs> That voice. You're right. <laughs> Oh, my Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> this is men lying. Yeah, yeah, so it's yeah. Like how, how, how, how men? He's a, he's describing question how, question. how, who, how men lie. Yeah, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. But like, but asking a question with a question. The way they uh, reply to the question <laughs> right. with a question, they make it worse. <laughs> who said that? <laughs> Where did you that from? But this, this like right. they'll they'll see a, a woman's underwear in a man's uh uh like drawer right. or cabinet, and then he'll reply, "Which underwear?" Right, as if there's more than one. <laughs> right. Okay, I got you. Uh, oh man. <laughs> I didn't, I, didn't get that I didn't get that one. Uh-huh. I get it now. Yeah, 
Öyle yaratılmış. Şimdi yanındaki hanıma soruyorsun ya nasılım sence falan diye. Niye soruyorsun? Bir şey duyup ikna olmak istiyorsun. Nasılsın? Kadın da bunu duyuyor. Sounds about right. Yeah. Nasılsın sence? Çok çok sıklısın. Bak bak. Bu cevap hiç sekmez ya. Çok çok sıklısın. Ve hemen erkek buna inanır. Ya yakışıklılık bu kadar görece bir şey değil ki. Elini vicdanına koy. Yani yani yakışıklı mıyım? Bence öylesin. Bilmiyorum. Sence mi? Sebep? Bence ki. Yani bu bölgeden ayrılma diye. Bence yakışıklısın. Kamuya açıl. Bu bölgede yakışıklısın işte. Ha, i̇yi o zaman ben buradan ayrılmayayım. Sorry, I, I, I hate stopping, but this that joke of being handsome in this area reminds mm-hmm. me of. Have you ever heard of uh, Flight of the Concords? Yeah, the song, uh, the the artist, the the show. No, they're a duo from New Zealand, and I I say this because it reminded me of that that line. They have a song called "You're the Most Beautiful Girl on the Street." <laughs> nice. So, you know, you're the most beautiful area. <laughs> yeah, you're handsome here. Yeah, <laughs> but don't go over there. Yeah, exactly. So I just wanted to <laughs> say that. Jude Law var, ben varım bak. Jude Law sen. Hangisi? Hayır sen. Street mi? Kim inanır lan? Hayır, Jude Law diyor. Sen yakışıklısın. Lan. Yemezler. Ama yeniyor. Çok çok yakışıklısınız. Bence. Tamam o zaman evi senin üzerine yapayım. Yazlık benim üzerime olsun. Niye inanılıyor buna hiç bilmiyorum. Ama inanılıyor işte. Yes yes. That's it. That's funny. Uh, that is funny. Funnier about the guys, like uh, oh, yeah. relating to what the guys are saying, dude. Yeah, I and like I said before, there, there's there's at least some truth to to what's oh being, for sure. Um, and comedy is always about over exaggeration, but mm-hmm. it's just, I, yeah, I think it was uh, well executed. Uh, the the jokes that he. The truth about the jo- or the jokes about the truth, mm-hmm. uh, yeah, like you said about the men and just how we're naive and we we believe. <laughs> He's a funny stuff. guy talking, and then yeah. his little voices when he's talking about yeah, the, boy, guys the, or girls or whatever. He's the mocking or yeah. the mimicking. Uh, I don't. For me personally, I don't think it was as funny as like the previous ones. Some of the other stuff you've seen, but like is. the previous ones I saw that were like to me they were like so. Like it's set such a high bar that it's kind of hard to reach yeah. that bar. Uh, you can tell he's a good comic. Yeah, yeah. Uh, comedy is it's it's a lot harder it's to so hard dude. Um, to uh, tr- translate not literally but like to translate the expressions and right. If if he, if he can make people who are not Turkish laugh, right? I would say that's a pretty damn good comic. Totally, hundred percent. Um, yeah, yeah. I this was good. Like I said, not as good as the previous ones I saw, but like the other ones were so good that right. It's hard for him to you know keep you know at that <laughs> level, but still this uh, this was good and uh, I enjoyed it. Yeah, I especially know. like the the relation how like there's some truth to it. Exactly. Most comedy comes from your own personal life, right? Yep. And your uh-huh. own personal experiences and stuff. And so it's true. It hits. I mean, it hits home definitely. Being a guy and like being able to understand what he's talking about—that's definitely funny. And you, I don't know. It's like some comics, you can tell they work really hard sure. for their laughs, right? They gotta work and uh, over exaggerate and just kind of they they em- em- embellish. Their jokes and stuff. He's just a funny guy. Like, if I went out to dinner with him, I'd probably laugh the whole time. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, he just seems like a really funny guy. Yeah, yeah. So I, Very I, charismatic. I, yeah, I like that about him. So, he's cool, and he tells the truth. Woman were created to convince, yeah. Yeah. Because they're, like... Like, where would we be without women, right? 
Uh, it's exactly that's what he's saying. Uh, essentially, like, well, it, it's just like he made me think about the whole like bringing up like you uh, when you're raising boys, you just kind of be like, oh, boys will be boys type of thing. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, they knock their race. It's like, hey, you want me to do it again? Yeah, yeah let's do it. Again. You know, <laughs> he kicks it. But like when the girls, you know, they're like. Oh, I saw you with somebody who was like, no, I was with my friend. I was like, why are your pants with whatever? Mm-hmm. So it's like, it's the balance between comedy and reality, I think. Absolute was truth. Well balanced. Because so. that's how my kids were. Yeah. It's like, hey, uh, why the heck would you do what you just did? Well, Ellie did it. Well, who's, I mean, I'm talking to Sophie, right? Let's yeah. say I'm talking to Sophie. Why would you? Why did you just do that thing? Oh, Ellie did it. No, she didn't. Like what? And then so they like try to create well, this elaborate well, story yeah. to get you to believe well, that know, they but... didn't do it, or they only did sure. it because this other kid did it. So, like, yeah, I totally understand what he's saying. His three-year-old. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Kids are great. They're the best. Oh, uh, depends who you ask, but all right. All right, guys, that's he's it for fun. this video. Do you have any last comments? No, he's just fun. He's good. I like him. Yeah. I just like him. He's if you guys funny. liked it, uh, for sure he's funny. Just let us know that you guys uh, like this format and we'll try to uh, to do more, you know, Jamil Maz, or maybe you guys have other recommendations for other comedians, preferably with English subtitles. Uh, Obviously. Well, it has so. to be with it. Not preferably. It has to be with the English yeah, subtitles. We can't like, watch comedy yeah. acts without <laughs> English subtitles. <laughs> Unless it's like, uh, what is it? Where they physical don't say comedy? Any, they don't say anything but their uh, well, mimes or something. Mimes yeah, or mimes or physical comedy where sure. they're just falling around. Mr. Bean or whatever. their head and getting... <laughs> uh, yeah. But yeah, guys, uh, like I said, uh, if you guys liked it, please let us know. If you guys didn't, politely let us know <laughs> we're branching out you know yeah, so we're, we're it's not it's uh, not gonna just be music right no and, uh, and it doesn't just have to be music no, i'm a big no. sports guy too i can react to soccer yeah if you guys have like maybe any some particular football sports videos. or whatever you want me to watch or uh, yeah football sorry i, football, I apologize football football videos, if there's interesting football. funny ones um yeah, well, that's it for this video, guys. Sorry for ranting too much and talking too much, but uh, but hey, that's what one. happens when I'm here. And uh, yep, this is it. See you guys in the Love next one. Love you guys. Time.